Uh, so much text. Alright, where are we at? Budapest. Thermal Bath Hotel. Thermal? Okay. The Thermal Bath Hotel. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Budapest, a peaceful summit being held. Attending all alert leaders of the great nations. Blah, blah, blah. None of these notables. Alright. Staring at terrorist. Someone's blowing up the, the hotel. Why not? I don't know why... Well, I guess the UN would have everyone get together, I suppose, from time to time. Because I'm like, why are all the presidents in one spot? This seems like a terrible idea. Let's just put all of the major targets in one location, conveniently, in this specific building with terrible structuring or something. <laughs> so that when they go in, it just collapses in on itself anyway. Alright, so kill the guy with a bomb. Alright. Popular with governments, that would be pretty good. Alright, let's go ahead and down some terrorists. I'm cool with that. France Fuchs. Alright. Rendezvous. 55, was that? Getting paid a lot for this, and I don't need money. <laughs> Look at that ugly bastard. Highly trained terrorist. He just looks fat. I don't know how well of a terrorist he can be. I don't think anyone that weird um, wouldn't draw attention. Oh my god, this place is huge. Um, I don't like this scrolling. I just... Okay, there's something here on the second floor. First floor? Second floor. First floor? First floor. Oh, I see. Outside. There's the rendezvous point, I guess. Um, where everyone arrives. First floor, come on. So there's where I want to go for some reason, I'm not sure why. Can't move to the left. So we don't need to know about the kitchen, apparently. Uh, two. There's another thing on floor two up there, in the same spot here. Floor three. And same spot. This spot's really active, whatever this is. Maybe there's like a stairway here or something, or... I think we got a dentist. And then... This random closet. Alright. I guess that's good enough. Alright, now... Seeing as how this is a high-level place, I don't think that I'd be allowed to have a knife in here. I'm also questioning if I'm allowed to have anything else. Oh, why can't I have a silenced one? Or do I just always have my silenced one? Um... I'm not sure. Why are these here if I can't have them? Is this just like in the field? Is this notifying me? I don't need to read up on it now. <laughs> Alright, um... I guess we'll go in with with my favorite gun. Oh god, there's a lot of expense to those bullets though. It's hardball it, I guess. If I'm gonna be making noise, I might as well use a fair gun. They all use... what? They all use the same ammo, but this one's five dollars. Alright, sure, whatever. Kevlar armor, of course. Binoculars, I don't think I need binoculars. Or a compass. If I get lost in a building, then God help us all. Alright, we're good. to past at the Thermal Bath Hotel. What a classy looking place. And well guarded, too. It's time to look sharp and concentrate. A good thing I brought my suit. It's true. That sh that sh suit is sharp enough to cut through steel. All right. So I'm outside. The rendezvous's just a around the corner, and there's invisible walls right here. Amazing. Gonna just kill the guard. <laughs> just walk in. Oh yeah. See, these here. Our sophisticated metal detectoring technology. Let me just go through here. If that had worked, I'd have been very pleased. Um, I fear that I'm going to fail instantly from walking through this. Because you're going to be like, hey, you can't have that gun here. I knew it. It was all a lie. It was a hoax. 
Shoot them all. They're killing each other. Dodge and weave. Dodge and weave. They'll never hit me. Look at that guy rolled. <laughs> I don't know why they let me come here with a gun if their very first door is going to have police, who I can't kill apparently, and metal detectors. What the hell? <laughs> this is a forced... This is a forced s s stealth mission. You have to go in there with wire. Because there's no way anything else is going through there. And I can't go around the building to my rendezvous point and sneak in through the back, which would have been the most logical move. Like, what the hell? Well, apparently I don't want this. Let me take this off. I'm a little bit concerned. Well, no, Kevlar is not metal, so... Kevlar is just a highly knitted um, cloth around, I think, a ceramic? So that shouldn't anger anyone. Um, wires should be good. I don't... Unless the Beretta is made out of plastic. Let's look. Um, I would like to know about this weapon. Yes? No? Maybe. No. Okay. You, you know what? Because I just go in and die anyway. Let's go ahead and just see if I can get the Beretta through. I doubt it's made of like plastic or anything. It's probably going to set it off, passed. but who knows? I'm Maybe I'm wrong. Bath hotel. What a classy looking place. And well guarded, too. It's time to look sharp and concentrate. A good thing I brought my suit. You'll never take me down! Go, go, go! Don't close the door again. They'll never know. Ah, oh, I'm so stealthy. There's a desk there. What is this? Uh, go, go, go! Move, move! Hello. Uh, 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 why? Uh. Yeah, so this is a full stealth mission. D why does no one tell me this? I mean, yeah, I could have suspected the idea. It's like this highly high officials and stuff. There's going to be metal detectors. To some degree, I expected a high level of security. But could if I can't buy random guns, like down here... I'm hoping these are in the field. It makes sense if they are. If not, then I don't know why these are even here. But if I can't bring a gun with me, why even let me buy it? <laughs> it's so stupid. Alright, there we go. That's perfect. Because the knife will trigger, the, these two guns will trigger. It's literally use wire or nothing. But it passed. I should have bought bullets, though. That was potentially stupid of me. Looking place. And well guarded, too. But you would think bullets would set off the... um. A good alarm. I brought my suit. If I set off the alarm this time, I'm going to just start punching people. You don't want to say anything now? You don't want to say anything after all you've done? Alright, let's go. There's a restaurant there. Oh. Such a ritzy place. It's like painted with gold everywhere. Pool area. Oh. <laughs> I, I may have gone the wrong way originally. I'm almost questioning, though, seeing as that's the beginning. Let's see what happens if I just scare someone in here. This is a woman's dressing room. So obviously you cannot enter with your present sex. But Chef has meat cleaver that could fix your problem. If I do this... Oh, wait, can I? I can't even get close enough to open the door. You fat bastard. I'll push you out of the way. Alright. <laughs> Why didn't she stop me before? I guess it's because the cops were following me. I just d ran in here. Why does it have to be the first one that was... That was just convenient that I ran into the wrong one. She should have been like, no, no access, for you are a man. And then I would have been shot down by a bunch of policemen. <laughs> you look shifty. Alright, so there's pool area. You got an elevator here. Uh, authorized personnel only. Sounds good. No? Okay. Apparently, Hitman does not believe in breaking the law towards authorized stuff, but is willing to walk straight into the women's, um, women's pool section. 
Of course, the only thing stopping him was that other person, but I'm just running into these random doors. Open it. Come on. I don't care if it's locked. Open it anyway. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing. This building is huge. I'm just, like, scoping the area, mostly. Um. No! Please! Okay. God, there's so much crap here. Alright, well, I guess I'll just scan the first section. There's bound to be weapons hidden somewhere. There's no way. Well, I guess they could make it a stealth mission. But I feel like it's iffy. You know, like, am I seriously expected to go to the end and kill a guy with a bomb using a wire? That's pretty gutsy. That's like bringing a knife to a gunfight. You might win, but, you know, chances are fairly low. Alright, so that's where I came in, I think. And that's nothing. Oh. Don't mind me. <laughs> Just checking out your bathroom, making sure you have all the right towels. No one's gonna question me. It looks like a door, but it isn't a door. Scary. Alright, now... This is the way I came from, right? Yes. Okay, good. Just making sure that this wasn't it, and I just forgot. It happens from time to time. 109? No. 110. I could just kill these civilians, and a part of me wants to, but, um... I think I have the same picture at home. No, no, I think I have a different picture. I don't know why pictures of deer are, like, just kind of a norm. I guess back in the hunting days. I don't know. There are nice pictures, though, so. But I think a picture of, like, a house on a hill or something is probably more traditional. These places are mostly empty. gonna have to find, like, a room with a gun, and then just memorize the number it's in. We got stairs here. Stairs that say down, as far as I'm concerned, and yet, it didn't seem like down. I don't look at too many stair signs, though. I don't know if... I, I would think they would say up, if you're at the bottom. That's just, like, a kind of common sense. Alright, so there's the elevator. There's that dude, whoever that is. I was just thinking he like, looked very happy, but it's really just his mustache making him seem that way. I bet you I can steal someone's clothes here. That's probably what I want to do. What is this? Do it. <laughs> Just a hitman out in, like, swimming trunks. It's amazing. No one will suspect a thing. Are you guarding the door I came in through? What are you doing? I'm sorry, sir, but the hotel has a strict rule that says its guests must be dressed when walking around. I believe your clothes are in the last booth. Please change. Okay. That's fairly reasonable. It's odd, but it's reasonable. Just that he would actually go through the whole task of... <laughs> I'll smother someone with a towel. Okay, fine. Um, that he would go through the 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 work of actually moving to the other door to stop me. I don't know. I have a towel, and I'm going to kill you with it. Can I actually hit people with this? I don't think I can. Um, can I use this? Just waste their water. They'll never stop me. Alright, so we got a pool here. I'm suddenly swimming. This guy's just out in the middle of nowhere. 
why is this pool so empty? I guess it's just because, like, if you're in, like, a popular hotel that has a fair amount of people, eventually you just come across the pool. Like, if it's always open, it's just empty sometimes. Because no one actually cares to go swimming all the time. Why are they just random showers? Oh, these are steam rooms. It's a pretty crappy steam room, but it works. Oh my god, could you, like... I'm just, like, thinking to myself, if we could, like, get someone to go in here, that you could turn this on and just, like, pressure cook them or something, you know? They would just sit in there and cook to death. It'd be terrible. I found the woman's bathroom again. Those showers are still going. No one's going to stop it. I don't know what that was about. There's really nothing that could be achieved there. Oh! Oh! Don't do that. Jesus. <laughs> I didn't think he left his weapon behind. Which, I mean, I guess I should have expected, because he didn't have anywhere to put it. Unless he really was a... A hell of a hitman who's willing to take one for the team, I suppose. But that seems a bit much. I don't think anyone should try that. Alright. So the first level's clear. I've discovered there's... Wait, never mind. There's still a restaurant. I forgot about it. This is... Well, I guess it's a dancing area. I was like, this is a terrible restaurant. There's not enough tables to fill the place. It doesn't seem like there's really anything speaker-related, though. I guess they could just have a few violinists and stuff come in. That might be reasonable. Because I'm like, who's going to dance if there's no song? If there's no music? I have no idea. Ooh. I don't really care, though. I don't want a melee weapon. They're useless to me as far as I'm concerned. Ooh. I could. I could. I could not... Can you fix leave my kitchen at once? I'm calling security in ten seconds if you don't leave. Am I gonna get a timer? If I go into here momentarily and then come back, did that count? I'm just gonna run around here because I really don't care if you do call security. Oh, is this the back exit? I'm checking the map. Don't shoot it. He's backing. You're darn right I am. Do it. Oh my god, I did it. Put it away. We don't want people to know. You made me do this. You made me do this, chef. Leave my kitchen at once! I'm calling security what? in 10 seconds if you don't leave! I am security. You know what? You know what, Chef? You think you could just boss around security people? That don't happen like that. I better run because I swear to God I think I heard the door. How's it going? Yeah, don't go in there. Ever. What is this? Is this a bathroom? Is this a bathroom I probably shouldn't go to? Yes. <laughs> Open all of the doors. I'm I'm security officer. I'm, I'm just securing. Eh, there's nothing in here. What if he put the bomb in here? That'd be like the best hiding spot because... Okay, well, no, it wouldn't, but... It, it would be kind of reasonable, because no one would really check, I suppose. But you wouldn't really accomplish much, I wouldn't think, with a bomb there. Um, I guess on the plus side, I did just gain up a rank, and now I am in higher level of security. But I did kill a civilian and a police officer. You gonna, you gonna talk to me? No? Why do you have the ability to talk? if you're going to be a mute. Um, Alright, well, I'm a security officer, and I've got a gun, so I'm happy. Ooh. 
Um. Mm. This might be a problem, but I am an officer. Oh, look at that. It could be that there's a... Hey! What the hell? What's wrong with you people? What's wrong with you? Run the other way. Run! Run, lady! Be the body! Shield that I need. I'm out of bullets. <laughs> okay, first of all, I'm gonna buy bullets, because I probably should have some. Second of all, I don't know what the hell just happened, because... Either they found the body and traced it to me somehow, or the metal alarm went off, even though... I can't even buy bullets if I don't buy the gun. Huh. Alright, then I guess we're going with nothing. At the Thermal Bath Hotel. I don't know why this video <laughs> continues to talk to. after being skipped. It's time to look sharp and concentrate. A good thing I brought my suit. Alright, well... There's metal detectors all throughout this building. If I took the elevator, I wouldn't have gone through a metal detector, though. But, I kind of question this all, because I don't know why they turned on me suddenly. Am I not supposed to be up here, in general? No. Good. I don't know what happened. Because I didn't set off the alarm... And I didn't kill anyone else at random while I was outside. I didn't have a weapon out. Even if I did, though, I was an officer, as far as they could tell. I'm not going to question it. Whatever. I'll worry about it when I need to. First things first, check every room that ever existed. What do you want? Can I see Mr. Wolf? Not without an appointment. Okay. Some other time, then. Mr. Wolf. No. Wait a minute. Can I? I don't know. I'm just like questioning if I kill him, do I get the keys to the entire place, you know? Because he is the janitor. Like, guy. And these, this is the key. Oh, it could be the key to this specific spot, though. You'd think they would have a master key, but I suppose... I don't know, do they make locks with two different key sets? Like a master key for all of them, and just, like, random keys for everything else? Other than, like, those scan ones? Because these are actual keys. Like, this isn't a scanner door, that's a key door. So you'd have to use a specific setup. <clears throat> Whereas the scanner might be able to do more. I shouldn't be killing the random... I shouldn't do that. I'd rather kill an officer and gain a higher rank than become a bellboy and pretty much gain nothing. Oh! <laughs> well, this is a problem. <laughs> I didn't think he'd take it. Because there was no option to do it. Just close the door. But he just took it. Um. You know nothing. Hey, man. You, you seem to have lost something. You okay? Can I take this? <laughs> take over his job. Slowly. I'll just take his key. Then I'll take his vacuum. Then I'll take his suit. And I'll just walk around as though I'm him. I gotta stop doing that. Okay. So now do I have access to basically every room because of that? I might want to keep an eye on this, though. 202, in case I need to reference that. Alright, now I can actually pay attention to what I'm doing. So now, which way is this? Where does this go to? So it's to the scanner. Okay. Just recheck all the rooms, because I didn't pay any attention to what the hell I was doing when I came through the first time, and I also may have gained access to all rooms. I don't know why I'm bothering, though. There could be a bomb in one of these rooms, though. Like, what if he decided, I'll put it on, like, in room 203 or some crap, and I didn't check it, you know? It's possible. Oh, 
Oh, okay, that's all the rooms here. There's another guy. I don't know, you'd think they would notice though if it was a if there was a bomb somewhere. Maybe I should just ignore it then. I'm gonna end up checking every room in the house and just be like taking forever. So maybe I shouldn't bother. If I look at the map, it'll tell me anything I need to really know, I suppose. Come on, it's so difficult to click this very, very small text. Alright, so... Um... First floor, I checked every room. I think that might be the elevator. Yeah, that's the elevator. So that's what that sign was for. That's the elevator through all the levels. Alright, there's a room in the casino... And a room on the third floor. Okay. And now that I've got keys to all the rooms, I can theoretically just... I don't know why I did that. I can theoretically just, like, break into the room and be done with it. Um. Alright. Let's go do the mission. I suppose. So, what should I do? Should I check out the casino first? It's on this level, right? Yeah. So let's head up the casino. That might be an elevator. We'll see. These symbols in this map are just terrible. But, it's okay. Ooh, a dentist. <laughs> Screw the casino. I'm exploring. My god, what if he has, like, some sort of, like, gas or something I can use to, like, knock out people? It'd be amazing. Where's this dentist? I was told there'd be free dentistry. Why is there just a dentist in the place? Who are you? Why do you exist? And why do you block me? All these questions and more. Hello. I have an appointment with Herr Fuchs. Is he in? I'm afraid not. Right now he is in the thermal bath. Wait a minute now. Isn't that the guy I'm supposed to kill? <laughs> Can I look at the desk? No. Isn't that the guy I'm supposed to kill? Is he a dentist? So he's a dentist who decides to kill random people in his own building. How interesting. Maybe. I don't know. Alright, well, I guess the dentist is out of order, so I guess I'll go to the casino. Gamble away all my problems. By creating more problems, of course. Um. Conference room. Probably shouldn't go there. Let's go. <laughs> Why would they let me in here? Unf peace conference. Alright. Sure. <laughs> Just plant a bomb underneath the desk and run away. It's way too easy to get in here. I could poison their drinks. You security guards suck unless I walk out and get shot. And in that case, I guess 50-50? Florist? Ooh. I'm too, I'm too interested in all the random places. I like to explore the map a bit, you know? It's nothing like figuring out all the things that... I should probably not mess with this... Nothing like figuring out all the places that How can I help you exist. First? I was wondering if you have something for me. Mm, no, I'm sorry. I don't think so. Um. What, what kind of a conversation was that? I was wondering if you had something for me. I doubt it. I'm not sure what I was asking him. And second of all, shouldn't he have just, like, recommended, like, a rose or something? <laughs> Like, I, I know just what you need. Uh, this red rose, and you can put it in your suit and shut the hell up and leave. <laughs> and be like, yeah, that's right, I can do that. And then I'd buy that flower and leave. What is this? What is this? What is this? Ah, what are these things? Tell me. Oh. Oh, is this a casino? Can I play a bit? Come on. Got a craps table here. Slot machines. 
Blackjack. It's written right there. Oh no, that's Russian Roulette. What was I talking about? I was just thinking about this little hook here. I'm like, oh yeah, that's craps or something, because they, they usually use the hook on the craps table as well. I think this is actually craps. I don't know. I've never actually looked at a craps board. I've seen the Russian the roulette wheel though. Um Alright then. What is going on in here? <laughs> Just access to anywhere I want to go. Oh, the bar doesn't want to talk to me, but everyone else will? What the hell? 